Want to know what you should do before visiting a car dealership with bad credit? Here are three simple tips I'm gonna give you today so you can be an informed shopper, get what you need, and drive what you want. My name's Chris Gonzalez, welcome to Cargonzo. So the number one thing you should look for when you have bad credit is one, visit their website and make sure that dealership has a good selection of vehicles. Making sure that those cars range anywhere from $10,000 to $25,000 ensures that you have a good selection for not just for yourself, but for these banks to consider for as a loan. The second thing you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna call the dealership and find out if they have a special finance department and get an idea of how many lenders they're working with. Dealers will tell you they have tons and tons of lenders, but you wanna specifically know and key in on a few, especially if you had bad credit. Number one, you'll wanna know if they have Santander, Credit Acceptance Corp, Capital One, and finance companies like this. Number three, you're gonna to wanna to call that dealership and find out if you can start some of the process before you actually step foot in that dealership. The importance of this is kind of being able to submit a credit application and get an idea of what you qualify for. But you wanna make sure you make it a point to say, do not send my application to multiple banks. If you can give me a good idea of what I qualify for before you start submitting that application, that'd be a good indication if you're dealing with a dealership that's gonna help you the right way. Many times we see credit applications that come across our desk and people have tons and tons of inquiries. And those inquiries really, really affect more than what you give them credit for. For example, if a bank looks at your credit bureau and sees that you have 30 inquiries on your credit, the number one question they have is, what did the other lenders say? Were you declined? Were you already granted credit? And it reduces your probability of getting a loan. So there you have three simple tips that you could use when shopping for a car with bad credit. You guys be great.